Members of our Herkimer are working to bring a new pop-up market to the Gail W. Brown Center on Fult Street. News Channel 2's Kirk Tupai tells us what you can expect to find at the market and where the products come from. Ark Herkimer is set to open a new pop-up market. The community will have the opportunity to purchase a variety of products ranging from handcrafted candles, aromatherapy, baked goods, art, and plants. Lori Ingersoll, the Assistant Supports and Services Director at Ark Herkimer, says all the products are handmade by the clients. It gives them the ability to make a product and be proud of that they're doing. Um, they get to see how this works from starting from something that's just a scratch and having a end product that they're proud of and can say this is my own. And it gives the socialization, just builds socialization as well. James McCauley and Joe Luby are two members of the ARC's Gentlemen's Group. The group spends much of their time working in the greenhouse. Joe Luby is busy getting the flowers ready for the market's opening day. I like working out here with Beth and, and stuff. I like planting flowers, I like doing stuff outside too. Clients like Joe can show off their creativity, learn to work as a team, and develop important social skills. Direct support professional Morgan Roberts says this group puts their heart into the products they make and the people that they work with. I wake up every morning and I'm super excited to come to work. That's the best. It's amazing. They're always great. Um, we always have fun. We're always doing activities. All the proceeds from the pop-up market will go back into providing programs for the clients at the ARC, and Lori Ingersoll is hoping the public will support their efforts. Just to have them come and see what we're about and what we can do, and then hopefully they come and they keep coming and they keep coming so that we can keep showing them what we're capable of doing. Our Kirkemer's pop-up market will be open here on Fold Street every Wednesday starting May 15th through October 16th from 10 a.m. until 1. In Herkimer, I'm Kirk Tupai reporting for News Channel 2.